That's right. Back to school week here on Living 808. We have so many great athletes and martial artists here in the islands, and one art has produced a lot, produced a lot of local, national, and international champions. The IKF, or International Karate Federation of Hawaii. Joining us now, Sensei and Head Instructor George Kotaka. Thank you so much. It's been Thank a while so since, since I've actually interviewed you. It was back, way back when, when you were kind of just competing. Doing, yeah, you were competing. Two-time world champion, folks, right here. Um, tell me uh, about the IKF and, uh, of Hawaii and, uh, and all that it's doing. Sure. Um, our International Karate Federation uh, was founded by my father, uh, Sensei Chuzo Kotaka, here in Honolulu, Hawaii in 1966. So this past year, we made 50 year, um, 50th anniversary. Wow. Uh, we're a school that has uh, 12 locations on Oahu. We're also, uh, we have locations on the West Coast in Sacramento, Seattle, Bremerton. We're also international in Tokyo, Japan, um, and also in New Delhi, India. Wow. Hey, I forgot to do this, by the way. I forgot to go. Oh, oh. Sensei. <laughs> sensei Clarice, by the way, was my sensei oh, way wow. back when, when I was a kid. Okay, so you recently sent a, a big group of students to the, compete in the 2017 Amateur Athletic Union Karate Nationals in uh, North Raleigh, North Raleigh, Carolina? North Carolina. How'd you guys do? Uh, we did awesome. So we took 31 students from Hawaii. We also had a 31? 31 students, wow. yes, a big group. And uh, we also had 15 students from our um, Sacramento branch. So in total, we had about 202 medals. 100 uh, in 14 of them were gold, 54 uh, silver, and 34 bronze medals. Wow, yeah, congratulations. Thank you so much. You're going to hear them clanging around here in a minute. But uh, are you excited uh, for Karate to be finally included in the Summer Olympics? Because oh, I know that that's a big deal. Definitely. Um, it's been a long time waiting, but uh, 2020, Karate um, has been inducted to the uh, Olympic Games in Tokyo, Japan. Um, we're very excited, and it will be such a huge privilege for us to actually have one of our students um, actually become an Olympian and represent the state of Hawaii and obviously the country of the, um, our, our country. And that's part of what the NKF is doing for exactly. you guys. And I imagine there's a huge push now for young kids like it was for judo. I would imagine there's a huge push for kids to do that. Yes, the, um, the NKF um, basically stands for the National Karate Federation. Mm -hmm. This is one of the main governing bodies uh, in the United States for the sport of karate. So next week um, from uh, July 19th to the 23rd, um, in South Carolina, um, South they're Carolina. Yeah, wow. they're going to be con, um, hosting the U.S. Uh, Nationals and the Teen Trials. So we do have a, um, a handful of students here today um, that are going to be competing next week um, to make the junior and also the senior national team. That's so awesome. Congratulations. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you for all that you do for the kids. And I love that, that, that you're sharing what you've learned over the years and what you've been able to do on a national, even a world stage, and share that with our youth. And, and a good luck to them and, exactly. and to you, of course. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. I, I'm, there's a name that rings a bell, too, Elisa Ao. Elisa Ao is also from our school, IKF. Um, she's a three-time world champion. She is uh, myself, um, Elisa Ao, and then there's also another third person. So there's only three world champions that come out of the United States, two of which are from Hawaii. Wow. Congratulations. So we have a, we have a, a few students here to perform. Definitely. Uh, a few kumite, maybe yes, some kata. Sparring, yes, definitely. So we have um, Cervantes and D'Angelo. Um, they're going to be showing some of the kumite techniques that we teach our students. Awesome. Yes. <laughs> Whoa, got to watch out for that. <laughs> Good job, guys. Awesome. That's so awesome. Hey, um, real quick, if you want your kid to be thrown around like that, we've got more <laughs> folks coming in, but well, let's talk while we're showing them. Sure. Um, how can someone sign up? How can somebody be a student? How can yeah, they do for that? Sure. Um, we have a website you can go to. It's uh, www.ikfhawaii.com. Go to the website. We have a list of locations. Like I said, we have 12 locations on Oahu. Mm -hmm. So they, um, basically go to the website. There's a number that they can call, and they can basically sign up. We accept all age groups, um, as young as four and five-year-olds, all the way up to adults. Now, they took their medals off, but they walked in with a bunch. <laughs> For sure. Wow, thank you. Much more to come on Living 808.